Wednesday, in case you didn't mark it on your calendar, was Fairy Tale Day. By coincidence, it was also the day Conneaut Public Library chose to unveil its new fairy tale themed stained glass windows. Kids and patrons were invited, and a contest was held for children with the best costumes. Library staff was also dressed for the occasion. Tonight is the unveiling of the two new stained glass windows here at the Conneaut Public Library. I um, had them commissioned in honor of my mother, Martha W. Catro, who passed away September 4th of 2013. When I first came into this library, um, the new library, in 1998, and saw the stained glass windows, my dream was to have as many stained glass windows as possible here at the library. And when Debbie Zingaro, our director before Kathy Pape left, we all went together and we got a stained glass window panel in honor of her. There were quite a few donations made in honor of my mother. And so I decided to have the two windows commissioned to honor her and to give a gift to the Connie Public Library. One is um, Goldilocks and the Three Bears, and the other is Little Red Riding Hood and they're going to be unveiled shortly. When we start talking about this in November, uh, we didn't know that National Fairy Tale Day is February 26th, and I just happened to find that online when I was looking for some ideas for story hour and story time and lap sit classes, and I called up the artist, John Sheffer, who is of West Springfield, and he is also um, owns the company Glass Factor, and I called John and I said, John, do you think the windows can be done and installed by the 26th because it's National Fairy Tale Day <laughs> and they're fairy tale windows and what better way to unveil them than on National Fairy Tale Day. And then that it just took off from there. The staff of course got involved like we always do and everyone decided to become a character from uh, fairy tales and I am Maleficent, in case you didn't know, who is the evil one of Sleeping Beauty. Now, who's your buddy there? Oh, that's the crow, and I don't know exactly what his name is, because I haven't seen the Disney version, but I'm sure he's a Disney creation. in a book and John right away knew what I wanted. This is a special type of reverse painting on glass where you put the black paint on and then you pull it off with a dry brush. He fired some of these pieces four and five times to get the uh, shadows and the contours that he wanted in them. Um, if you come back in the daylight you can't believe when the sun is shining through that red cape. It's, it's amazing. Uh, it's better for taking pictures actually at night. Um, in, each pan in each panel, he has hidden a word in Finn um, to um, commemorate my mom. 